what is nothing but the hydrostatic paradox so basically guys this is the term related to the fluid mechanics and uh, pressure head basically so first of all let me tell you that what is pressure head so pressure head is nothing but the amount of the height basically suppose uh, a particular fluid which is enclosed in a container having height h so that h will be the pressure head for that particular uh, for that particular fluid basically so that particular pressure head we can calculate by using the formula of so h is equals to the total pressure exerted by that particular liquid on the adjacent walls of the container divided by the spe uh, specific weight of that particular liquid so the formula becomes pressure head h is equals to p divided by the specific weight we can ca we can uh, like we can denote the spe specific weight by gamma so ultimately specific weight is nothing but my density into the acceleration due to the gravity so that becomes rho into uh, g acceleration due to the gravity so the h is equals to the p divided by rho into g so that will be the my the pressure head the formula for the pressure head as this particular pressure head increases by keeping the my bottom area or else the opening bottom area through which the water is flowing or through which the liquid is flowing is remains constant so if the pressure head increases the force of the liquid which flows will increase suppose i'm having a three containers basically this particular three containers having the at the bottom side it is having the same diameter d and uh, on the top side it is having the irregular shapes basically different shapes but the height maintained in that particular uh, containers is the same let's say water is filled over there in the container the height maintained is h that is the same for all the volume of all these containers is the different so that's why the ultimately the weight of each container will be different so as because the size is very much different but the bottom size bottom opening is the same or as the bottom diameter is the same for all as this particular bottom diameter of each container is the same so this particular pressure so the pressure which is generated at the bottom side of each container will be the same and this amount of the force which is exerted by that particular water molecules on the bottom side of the container will be same the amount of the force exerted by that particular liquid molecules at the base will be more than that of the actual weight of that particular fluid so this particular effect is called as the hydrostatic paradox and this particular hydrostatic paradox is like is it is it is the independent than that of the total actual weight of the fluid in the container it is purely depends upon the height that is nothing but the my pressure head and uh, the uh, bottom opening that is the diameter of the uh, diameter of the base basically so these two terms are very much important as we all know this pressure is nothing but the force upon area whereas the over here we have got the area that is nothing but the diameter which is same and the force that is purely depends upon my uh, pressure head basically so over here we can generate the height we can generate this pressure by the formula of uh, gamma into h whereas my gamma is my specific weight of that particular fluid into height so that is nothing but the formula to calculate the pressure at the base of each container so this the so the force exerted by the fluid molecules on the base is more than that of the actual weight or it is irrespective of the weight of the total weight of the fluid so this is nothing but the hydrostatic paradox thank you so much guys for watching this video